Hello, may the peace of the Lord be with you at this time. May God give you peace, health, protection, and prosperity. I want to tell you something from God. When I tell you these words, peace, health, protection, and prosperity, besides you receiving the blessing, who are the people who first come to mind who you know need to receive these same blessings? May this person have peace, good health, divine protection, because we are living in times when we need protection and also prosperity, because without prosperity you can't help the people you love. I want you to put it in the comments below. Write the name of the first people who come to your mind to receive these blessings. When I speak these words, which people do you want to receive peace, health, protection and prosperity from God? Write in the comments the names of the people you want to bless in this prayer. In this prayer I will ask God for your life and the lives of the people you write in the comments. Do you feel in your heart now that there is someone in your family? That there is someone you know, a friend, someone you love, who needs to join the powerful prayer for you channel now to hear this prayer? Click share. At the end of this prayer, share this prayer with these people. May God visit you and may the Lord also visit all the people you will share this prayer with. Let's pray. Let me pray for you right now. Lord our God, and our beloved and dear Father, on this day that I will call a blessed day, I want to ask you for the life of your daughter and for the life of your son. People who have a lot of faith in the Lord. This person who has a good heart. A heart that is not capable of harming anyone. And the Lord knows this because your word says that the Lord is the one who searches our hearts. The Lord knows. I want to ask at this moment for your son and daughter who are here on the powerful prayer for you channel. In this prayer chain and for all the people who come here for the first time at some point. I want to ask you for the peace that comes from the Lord. I want to ask you that the Lord touches this heart, this mind with peace. Because your word says that your peace, the peace that comes from the Lord surpasses all understanding. Even a person going through struggles, going through difficult times. If she is at peace, she can rest, she can sleep. A heart that has peace is an enlightened heart, it is a blessed heart. It is a protected heart. May the peace of the Lord touch this heart. May the peace of the Lord become stronger and remove any and all feelings that do not belong to you, that are not the Lord's. Dear and beloved Father, I also want to ask the Lord to give good health to your son and daughter, that wherever this prayer reaches that all the people who hear this prayer, by faith may the Lord be the God who heals, the doctor of doctors, Bless your son and daughter from the top of your head to your feet. May your son and daughter be in good health. May they be encouraged. May the blessing of the Lord be present in the physical area of your children. Protect your children's lives from all the enemy's traps. I declare and prophesy that the health of the Lord is upon our lives, upon our bodies. In the name of Jesus. God, I also want to ask you for your protection. I want to ask you for your release. Because we are living difficult days. Protect each person who is here in this prayer, right now listening to this prayer here on the Powerful Prayer for You channel. Lord, keep our family, our children. Your word says in the 127th Psalm, that if the Lord does not protect our home and our family, Everything that is done will be in vain. So my God, the greatest and first protection we want and ask for now is your protection. Protect our family and our children. Deliver them from the fowler's snare. In Lord Jesus' name, protect your son. Protect your daughter. The people who are here with me now in prayer, protect their lives. Not only them, but also all their family members. 
May all your son and daughter's family now be touched through the life of each person who is here listening to this prayer. In Lord Jesus' name, God, I also ask that the Lord will prosper your son. May the Lord prosper your daughter. The Lord knows their hearts and knows that if they prosper they will not let vanity reach their hearts. But may their prosperity come to the glory of the Lord. May they prosper to fulfill, to realize their dreams, and also help those they love. May your son's prosperity, may your daughter's prosperity be for your honor, for your glory and for your praise. In Lord Jesus' name, raise one of your hands and say, I receive the blessings of this prayer. In Lord Jesus' name, and you say Amen, and say glory to God. Do you receive this prayer? May the peace of God, may health, protection, and prosperity be upon you and all the people you included in this prayer. Before leaving, I ask you to share this prayer. Click Share. May the first people be the ones you put here in prayer to receive this blessing. May each share like this be a light that you are sending to someone and for the good you are doing. May you reap the good too. May many blessings return to your life. Because whoever does good, he reaps good. I want you to pray today the Psalm 23 and Psalm 91, the two most powerful psalms in the Bible. It will be very good for you to pray these psalms today. I will leave in the video description and in the first comment the powerful prayer of Psalm 23 and Psalm 91 for you to pray. May God bless you so much. May it give you a day of peace and lots of good news.